Alright guys, I'll continue my story a bit later. This is getting quite noisy on the side with the power tools and the construction. So this is our tour guide Amy and she is starting the tour now. We're going to the castle right now. I'll give you the name a bit later. And uh, just so you know, this is a free tour. Okay, so it's called the Dublin Castle. <laughs> what do you know? Alright, and we're on our way. Some more tour groups on this side. And by the way, it comes in different languages, guys, so you obviously just gotta say what's your preferred language. Now, guys, we're going to begin right here. Um, I find it lovely when people sign up for a free tour on a day like today. I'm hoping that the forecast will stay with us, though I keep checking all the different apps and I feel like they're gaslighting me now. One will say rain, one will say it's going to stay dry. As long as we keep walking, keep the blood pumping, we should be okay. We'll do um, two little stops here within the Dublin Castle allotment. Then we're going to head around the corner and out onto Ship Street. We'll do a few minutes there before heading up to Christchurch Cathedral from there we're going to go into Temple Bar do a little bit about the history of that area and then we're going to have a little break so you know the storehouse pub that we've just met outside by the time we get back there in and around 70 minutes my friends will have the bar open we can go in we can use the bathrooms they have discounted drinks on for you because you're on my tour we can have a little quick cup of tea or coffee. Now, I don't force the consumption of alcohol at this hour. I'll encourage it. I'm not going to force it. But if you want to have a drink, they'll have a discount on for several different options. We are standing above the first ever Viking settlement of Ireland. So it's a lovely kind of double-edged sword here. And that's why I like to begin here every morning. Now, you'll notice when we walked in, there's a slight incline in the site here. Can you see that? A little bit of a hill. Now I know this is going to sound crazy, but the point under the archway where the group are walking down towards us is the highest point in Dublin city centre. It's pathetic. <laughs> it doesn't get any higher than that gang. Just now celebrating and enjoying 101 years of Irish independent rules in all the hundreds of years that it's been here. It was first used as a wardrobe to later on. From here, I'd like to take this just down this way and point it to my side with the sculptures on the side of the chapel before we go around the corner. Bishop's hat. He is the main patron saint of Ireland. Can anyone guess? Patrick. Yes, exactly. <laughs> That's exactly who he is. Now, a lesser known fact about the saints of Ireland is we actually have three, but this guy is the main saint. He's been hogging all the attention since the fifth century. The other two saints that we have are main patron saints. That was very interesting, guys. We learned about St. Patrick and Brian Baru. Uh, I'm going to give you a bit more details in the description about that. But some of the history behind St. Patrick and where he comes from, his mission, and all sorts of stuff. Really interesting. You're looking, you're looking a bit worse for wear now, boss. Ah, here, hold on now, hold on now. Did you have no, a few? I left it. I think I just lost my group, guys. Oh, so, then they went this way. Ah. Oh. No? Found him. Hence the big welcoming symbol on it. Now, if you have access to a helicopter, your life is probably pretty good already. But it must be a beautiful thing to see from the sky, particularly when you have the backdrop of the medieval tower and the chapel royal just here. So we'd actually use it a lot, like more than you'd think.
John Smith's alleyway, but it is also known by the Irish as the Steps of Hell. It was first uh, constructed here, or erected I should say, in the year 1030 AD. whiskey can turn your eggs a little bit but uh, maybe a five minute gap in between the two a lovely Thank you. 